Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Funny for Friends. Today we're going to be going over some funny animals. Uh, I thought I had a theme, but I don't think so. I think it's just uh, the world's funniest pets, basically. And so I don't have... Yeah, no, I... You're right. Yeah, sorry. You're right. I'm right. World's funniest pets. Let's react to them. Also, don't forget to go check out Patreon if you want to listen to some fun true crime mystery stuff. Um, because I want to learn where the Jane Doe comes from, and I think that is going to be the next theme. Laughable moments, fun uh, traveling adventures, and then, um, I'm trying to think here. And it's also going to be funny travel stories. I think I'm going to switch it up, maybe. Maybe do some other stories, like, like funny summertime stories, you know, funny campfire stories, stuff that happened then. Um, and then if you want to tag me in some an funny animals, my TikTok is down below and you can go check out my own dogs and see their channel. Okay, and um, let's get going here and react to some, some of the world's funniest pets. Okay, number one, here we go, world's funniest pets. Just the way he's sitting, he's like, this. You want this? You want some of this? <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> That's like cat doing ballet almost. Oh, my God. So, they're very flexible. <laughs> it's like, I got a sunbathe, but it's too hot. But I can't go out. It's like, hello. Come, like, come here often? <laughs> Is that his tail? Oh, no, those are his paws. I thought that was his tail holding, holding him up. Oh, frozen. <laughs> and, oh, my God, the eyes. <laughs> Pet me. Pet me. Now, okay, this one here looks like an owl slash... The Pringle guy. God. Love it. Which one was your favorite? Do you guys have funny cats that sit like that? That act like in a funny way that you're like, is this normal? I'm curious. Let me know in the comments below. Okay, number two. Here we go. Oh, oh, there we go. Oh, it's freaking out. Oh my god. That that poor lion. <laughs> Kitty's like, uh, this is the way. Let me fight. No foods. Oh let me see. Oh. <laughs> let me get the shoelaces. Oh, okay. Oh, Starfish! Starfish! Oh, shaking. The cat is pooping. Just peeing. Like, thanks. <laughs> Just pooping. Showing their toughness. Oh. 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 That's funny. Did that person not know that cat was just there? I love cats. I'm turning into a cat lover, but I can't have them, sadly, because I am allergic, but I wish I could. Okay, what do you guys think of that one so far? I'd love to hear your favorite cat. And then also, if you have an animal that acts funny or um, abnormal, but you, or sorry, you're questioning if it's normal or not, tag me in. Any of them on TikTok, like I said, it will be in the description below. Okay, on to number three. Oh, oh little flute. And what are you doing? That was a really cute cat. Oh. <laughs> like, oh, tantrum. It's like protective, but it's almost like I don't know if that's a protective mode or just the way that they are, but 
I'm wondering if that's what it is. However, I get the vibe of come here often. Oh, just <laughs> Can I get out of the litter box, buddy? Oh, the tongue. That tongue is so cute. I do not like cat tongues. It is a weird feeling. We'll speak. And I don't know. If, I'm assuming all cat tongues are the same, but I don't like that feeling of a cat tongue. Let me know if you guys feel that way, too. Again, let me know in the comments below if you have questioned a behavior of your pet before. Okay, I don't know what happened, but I lost my thing, so I gotta redo it again. Okay, my thought, so what I was saying before that, before I lost the recording there, was if you, I wanted to answer the fact if your dogs have questionable behavior. There's one that I'm not too sure of, um, for my, one of my former dogs, he unfortunately passed away a couple of years ago. He had really, really terrible, uh, seizures. He had a lot of issues. Uh, behavioral issues and physical uh, issues. We did everything we could. Like granule seizures, really nasty ones, like both ends of like liquids, like pee and poo, would come out, and it felt so bad for him. It was really sad, but he was he was an overall good dog. He was just he just wasn't. I think he had some damage to him from all those seizures, but he was um throughout those seizures like ever since the seizures he started licking the couch licking the couch licking the couch and um he had his issues i loved him he was a very sweet dog but he loved having like poop under his like his butt always got stuck with poop it was always gross but i felt bad i loved him um sweet dog but i didn't know if that was a behavioral thing it could be but he kept licking and licking the couches, maybe the floors, and just one stop for like a good ten, solid ten minutes, you know, like something like that. So that was one questionable behavior. So that was more on the serious questionable behavior side. But yeah, anyways, moving on to this one here. Hmm. Give me a touch. Give me that. Like that song that the TikTok filter one. <laughs> That's what it reminds me. That's what it is. I just, I can't share it. Okay. And on to the next two. Okay, here we go. One year ago, still as funny as ever. Oh, no. This gets lost in the snow. Yeah, no, I'm good, Mom. Oh, the sweater. What is this? I don't, I don't know. No, thank you. <laughs> I love how quickly it becomes daisy. <laughs> Totally lost. I wonder if dogs could feel the coldness of the snow, or if it doesn't affect them because of their fur and the layers of their skin. Like it's different for us, obviously. What if they can? Oh, oh, is he building a snowman or is... oh, is he trying to do with it? Oh, he is. What? Oh, maybe making a ball. Cold as it is. Oh, yeah, no, too cold. <laughs> It's minus nine. It's actually it's actually warm for winter. Hmm. Grumpy because of cold cat versus dog. So funny. Um, how do your dogs react to winter? It doesn't matter for mine. They're happy either way. They I know my dog Ivy loves summer more. She'll bake in the sun. She's not big on, she she wouldn't do that in winter time. She'll do it more like that's it's nice to get a little break because she's constantly begging to go outside on the nicer days whereas cold winter um she she'll be in and out kind of thing like very quick okay and then we'll move on to the last one okay and the last one oh <gasps> Oh, oh, that's what they were, okay, sorry, I had to re I had to watch this to make sure I could post this one. Oh my god. <gasps> that's thousands of dollars of damage right there. Oh, oh my god. That dog really wanted it. It's the puppy. Um, oh, so, so much damage to the couches. This is why we put our dogs in kennels until they're trustworthy to not... Um, oh, 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 <laughs> just water, that's why, um, 
I need to make sure they're trustworthy enough to not need a kennel. And sometimes that never happens, and sometimes it does. Oh, oh, hi, it's like, nope, wasn't me, can't find me now. Oh, he's like, yeah, I did it. But I'm happy to see you. He's proud of his work, this guy. Let me, I want to hear what you guys think of those. Um, have your dog, have your dogs destroyed anything in your house that costed you more than a thousand dollars to fix? Comment below. You, you don't have to, you could comment how much, like even if it was less than that, doesn't matter. Comment below though, what damage was done when you first got your puppy or dog, rescue dog, whatever it was. Um, also, so for my, our emo, the one who had the ground wall seizures, he started pooping and peeing in the basement, and we tried to get him outside. Um, we didn't have that chance for some reason. Like, it's not, like we weren't fast enough somehow. But, uh, yeah, he would go in the basement and poop. So it was weird. Like, he would have to poop against the wall or against something. So it would splatter all down the wall. It's gross. It, there's so much of cleaning to do. Um, but, yeah, that was it. Anyways... That is it for me. I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day, and we'll chat soon. Bye now.